Hi again everyone, it's Wednesday, April 3rd, looking at the uh, rainbow key timing windows for today. We just hit the first uh, first windows here this morning since I've been watching. We had two side by side and what often happens in this situation, the turn came right in the middle between those two windows. So you can see that I've got this red trend line drawn here. We're in a strong upward trend period, and you can see the market started turning up just before that uh, change on the B1 and B2 column there. And now we're pushing upward. This time period is going to go to A20. Then we have another friendly window after that. So the implication is for the upside here this morning until we get to this um, white window here that comes in about 10 12 on the b1 so all the key windows i've got marked the first one we've got here is between 924 and 940 looking for something there where we have that white overlap see we've got the white on the a1 and the over the green a2 and then white a3 over A4, so right there, just about where that overlap is, is probably the key. And that's right on the session open, so you got to be careful when these land on the session opens. We can get some additional vol volatility. We've got this 10.11 to 10.42 window. We've got this little A5 overlapping in there, so that's the most likely spot for trend reversal then we've got two narrow window windows here on the uh, B1 we've got the green and then the white there and that's going to be between 1212 12 and 1219 and then the white windows from about 1235 to 1250 and then you can see we've got the uh, A3, A4 overlap there. And then we've got the A3, A5, A6 green overlap over the green window here. Then uh, the biggest window comes in this afternoon on the uh, B2 panel. You can see the bright green window. That window is running from 1355 all the way to 1515. Then we've got the B1 green and white above that those two windows right there marked out on the price chart 1355 to 1404 and 1411 to 1424 would be the key times in that window so you can see we had a very narrow overnight trading range after the sharp drop yesterday we broke out and made a slight new high there uh, out of that range made a little correction back into the other window now we're pushing back up and just made a new high out of that uh, little range there so now for prime trades we're looking for new highs and new lows outside of the overnight range anything that was inside the range would just be considered a scalp opportunity so there's the uh, setup for today for the key timing.